Hey guys, it's Gretchen from Gretchen's Bakery and I have a real quick video today with a new recipe for brownies. But these are not your ordinary brownies. These are made with black beans. Yes, I know it sounds totally weird, which is why I just had to try them. I got this recipe from Esther's Kitchen and for those who are not familiar with who Esther is, click the link below to check her out. She is fabulous. And her story is really amazing. You will fall in love with the brownies and her, I promise. All links are below this video. So yeah, I got the recipe from Esther's website and let me tell you, you guys know that I am in love with chocolate and if it is black chocolate, I have died and gone to heaven. These black bean brownies are the fudgiest brownies ever, so if it's gooey, rich, fudgy brownies that you like, you are going to love this recipe. Oh, and by the way, they happen to be flourless, gluten-free. Check it out. Obviously, we do need some black beans, and I am using canned here. Cocoa powder, maple syrup, vegan butter, baking powder and baking soda, flax meal, brown sugar, any milk alternative of your choice, and some chocolate chips and walnuts too. So first get the vegan butter melted and then you are going to flip at how easy it is to mix this recipe. Are you ready? Dump everything except for the chocolate chips and the nuts into a food processor and process smooth. Uh yeah, that's it. Spread the brownie batter into a parchment lined baking pan, top it with those chips and nuts and bake. Mm-hmm, I told you, easy and awesome. Rich, fudgy, deep, dark chocolate, gluten-free and vegan never tasted so good. So thanks to Esther's Kitchen, we now have another recipe to add to our favorites file. Be sure to head on over to Gretchen'sVeganBakery.com to grab the recipe. Go visit Esther and thank her and her two dads for the recipe. And if you like this video, I hope you'll give me a like. If you're not yet subscribed to my channel, I would love it if you will for the best vegan recipes coming at you weekly. Thanks as always to everyone for watching and until next time, happy baking. I'll see you soon.